Hi everyone, welcome to the session. In this session, we are going to discussing about some more problems related to averages. Let's see the first question in this session. See here, the average age of 80 boys in a class, that is 15 years. Here, the average of 80 boys is given as 15 years. So, definitely you will get sum of 80 boys. Sum of 80 boys is equal to average, that is 15, into number of boys, 80. So, that you will get uh, 15 8 sir, 120, 1 more 0, 1 to double 0 years. That is the sum of uh, 80 boys. And after that, the average age of a group of 15 boys in the class is 16 years. Here, among those 80 members, 15 members average is given. Among those 80 members, 15 members average is given, which is 16 years. Therefore, sum of 15 boys, sum of 15 boys, which is equal to average into number of boys which is equal to this is the average and this is the number of boys now 16 into 15 which is equal to 240 240 years after that the average age of another 25 boys which is given as 14 years and the 25 members sum of 25 boys if the average of any number of boys are given obviously you will get a sum of those members, uh, sum of 25 boys, which is nothing but average is 14 and the number of boys are uh, 25, which is equal to 25 into 14. Here it is uh, 250, 250 plus 100, which is equal to 350, 350 years. Now, out of total 80 members, out of total 80 members, 15 plus 25, 40 members sum is uh, 240 years plus uh, 350 years. That is the sum of uh, 40 members. Now the question is, uh, what is the average age of the remaining boys in the class? Here we need to find the average age of remaining boys. Remaining boys in the sense, still we left over with only 40 members. Why? Because uh, out of 80 members, 15 and 25. These many boys are completed. It means... Uh, 80 minus 40 which is equal to 40. Still we left over with only 40 members. We left over with only 40 members. Therefore, the average of the average of remaining 40 boys remaining 40 boys is equal to sum of remaining 40 boys. How can you get the sum of remaining 40? Here, the total sum of 80 members 1 to double 0 if you subtract 15 boys sum and also 25 boys sum, that is 250 and 350, you will get the sum of remaining 40 boys. This is the total sum of remaining 40 boys and you need to divide with 40. Why? Because number of boys left over, that is 40. Now you can do the calculation part for this one. Here it is 1200 minus here it is uh, 500 590 minus 590 divided by 40 which is equal to here the difference between these two 610 divided by 40 610 610 divided by 40 here 0 0 gets cancelled now you can take it as 1 5 15 point 2 5 15 point 2 5 years this is the required average of remaining 40 boys. Remaining 40 boys average is 15.25. Option A is the right answer for this question. Let's move on to the next question. See here. The average age of 32 boys in a class is 14 years. Here the average of 32 boys 14 years. Therefore, sum of 32 members sum of 32 members which is equal to 32 into 14 here you need to calculate 32 into 14 i will do the calculation part over here 32 into 14 here it is 8 and uh, 12 plus 2 14 and this is uh, 3 348 
and next after that the average age of 26 girls that is uh, 12 here it is 32 boys and uh, after that 26 girls therefore sum of 26 girls 26 girls is equal to 26 into 12 which is equal to here you can do the cal uh, calculation part 10 times is 260 after that uh, 2 times is 52 you can add these two you will get uh, 312 312 that is the sum of 26 girls now the question is uh, what is the average age of all boys and girls average of all boys and girls that is uh, 32 boys plus 26 girls which is equal to sum of all those members that is 348 plus 312 32 boys sum is equal to 348 and that of 26 girls sum is equal to 312 therefore 348 plus 312 divided by number of persons 32 plus 26 which is equal to 58 right here you can add these two 300, 300, 600, 600 plus uh, 60, 660 divided by 58. This is the required average value. And uh, in the given brackets, there is a sentence that rounded off to two digits after the decimal point. Here, after the decimal point, we need to calculate up to two digits. That is the sentence. Uh, 660 divided by 58. Here it is, uh, you can cancel with two table first, uh, then it will be reduced to 29 and this is uh, 330. Now you can cancel with uh, 29 table, 29 ones are 29, after that it is uh, 4, 4, 40, 40 means uh, 29, uh, here it is, uh, again it is uh, 330 divided by 58 and this is 29. 29, uh, 1's are 29 and 40, 40 is left over and next uh, here it is uh, one time again 11 point uh, something we are getting uh, once check it out the product here it is uh, 320 320 plus uh, here 32 fours 32 fours uh, that is not uh, 348 uh, here the error is at this point uh, 32 into 14 here it is 8 and this is 12 plus 2 14 and this is 3 plus 1 4 448 not 348 this is 448 now you can take this uh, value 448 and uh, add these to 760 760 and then it is uh, 380 380 right now this value is uh, 29 one sir 29 and after that you will be left over with uh, 90 90 in the sense that is uh, 3 times 87 point uh, again it is 1 after that uh, 0 13.10 13.10 option b option b is the right answer for this question guys uh, i hope you enjoy the session thank you thank you very much for watching